Though our commentary may be family friendly, this game is rated M by the ESRB. Hello and welcome to a brand new Let's Play here on Steven Plays. Today, Mallory and myself are jumping into Halo 3 because we've already tackled Halo 1 and Halo 2. So we are back to finish the fight. Before we get too far ahead of ourselves, quick shout out and huge thank you to all of our Patreon producers. Their names are scrolling across the bottom of the screen now. Thank you so, so much. If you're watching right now and you'd like to learn more about Patreon and uh, how you can support Mal and myself and the perks that come along with that, you can click on the card that's appearing now or there's a link in the description box down below. So Mal and I covered the original Halo, the well, the anniversary release, back in 2011. And then, we didn't touch Halo on the series for four years. It wasn't until 2015 that we finally played Halo 2 Anniversary. We had held out, we had waited on a re-release, and we got it as a part of the Master Chief Collection for Xbox One. Now, it's been almost two years since that Halo 2 Let's Play. People have been wanting to know, when was Master Chief coming back? Well, guess what? He comes back today. Now, the story of Halo is... It's, let me start off by saying it's great. I actually really love it. The lore is fantastic. It's really great science fiction lore. That said, um, it can be a little hard to follow. So Halo 3 is a great game. It's a good standalone game, but it might be best if we caught you up to speed very quickly. Now, if you want to watch through the Let's Plays, obviously I'm not going to stop you, um, but we figured it might be good to just give you a little bit of the backstory. Now, we did a, uh, a really good backstory of Halo 1 on the first episode of Halo 2 Anniversary, so I'm going to link that to you in the description and on screen now, so if you want to check out the backstory of Halo 1, check it out. It's just like, I'd say probably three or four minutes, well worth your time if you want to catch up on Halo 1. As for Halo 2, that's what I'm going to be jumping into in just a minute. Now, if you already know all about Halo 2 and you're like, no, no, I, I, I just want to see the game, well, there's an on-screen option for that as well, so feel free to click that. Now, as far as this run goes, this is going to be semi-blind. I call it semi-blind because uh, I have played this game before. In fact, I'd say Halo 3 was probably, in many ways, my high school game. I played the crap out of it, specifically multiplayer. And actually, Halo 3 is a game that Mallory has played as well. Yeah. Um, back when we, we started dating, I think in the first year, maybe, of us dating, we played through this together? Maybe. First or second. Um, it's interesting because we actually played Halo 3 without playing Halo 1 and 2, um, or at least Mal did. So I was kind of just throwing her into it, but she had a really good time. So even if you haven't played or seen Halo 1 and 2, you'll probably still enjoy yourself. Um, with that being said... I'm now going to transition into the backstory of Halo 2, so keep watching if you want to hear that. Otherwise, click the on-screen prompt, and let's jump into the gameplay. The full Halo 1 summary can be found in the description, but here's a super fast recap. The United Nations Space Command, UNSC, is flying through space when it stumbles upon a giant ring world, a Halo, and is soon after attacked by the Covenant, a religious alliance of aliens. On board the UNSC ship is Master Chief, a Spartan super soldier, and Cortana, the ship's artificial intelligence. He evacuates the ship to Halo, bringing Cortana with him. After exploring Halo and regrouping with the ship's survivors, Master Chief learns that Halo was built by an ancient alien race called the Forerunners, which the Covenant now worship as gods. They also accidentally release a parasitic alien race called the Flood, which destroys everything in its path, Covenant and UNSC alike. Releasing the Flood prompts the AI monitor of Halo, 343 Guilty Spark, to activate Halo's defense systems, instructing Master Chief to set in motion events that will wipe out all the Flood. The Chief follows orders until the last minute, when he realizes that Halo itself is a weapon, and in order to destroy the Flood, he would also be wiping out all sentient life in the galaxy. Instead, Master Chief and Cortana set off an explosion to destroy Halo, and narrowly escape. In a post credit scene, 343 Guilty Spark can be seen flying through space. This is where Halo 2 begins. We start off in the Covenant's mobile capital city called High Charity. Thelvadam, a Covenant elite commander, is being stripped of his rank for failing to stop the humans from destroying Halo. Thel pleads with the Hierarchs, the three High Prophets, Truth, Mercy, and Regret, that the Flood hampered his abilities, but they deem him guilty of failing to protect the Sacred Ring. The shouting crowd brands him a heretic, while he is tortured by Tartarus, the chieftain of the Covenant Brutes. Meanwhile on Earth, Master Chief and Sergeant Johnson are awarded for their actions at Halo. 
Commander Miranda Keyes accepts a medal on behalf of her deceased father, Captain Jacob Keyes. Soon after, a Covenant fleet appears outside the Earth's defensive parameter and begins an invasion of the planet. One Covenant cruiser, housing the High Prophet of Regret, assaults the city of New Mombasa, Kenya. Master Chief assists in clearing the city of Covenant, causing Regret to retreat. Keys, Johnson, Cortana, and Master Chief chase after Regret, who is unaware he's been followed. They're led to an eerie discovery, another Halo. Realizing the danger this presents, Keys sends Master Chief to kill Regret, while she and Johnson find the Index, Halo's activation key. Back on High Charity, the High Prophets of Truth and Mercy have come to an agreement about Thel. Though the destruction of Halo was his fault, he is no heretic, so they offer him the honored position of Arbiter. This will allow him to continue to fight for the Covenant directly under the supervision of the Hierarchs, but the Arbiter's position is a dangerous one, where he will be given impossible tasks that inevitably end in death. The Arbiter's first task is to assassinate a heretic leader who is disillusioned with the Covenant after the destruction of Installation 04, uh, the Halo from the first game. The heretic leader tells the Arbiter that the Prophets have lied about the Great Journey. Shortly after, 343 Guilty Spark shows up on the scene along with Tartarus, and the heretic leader is killed before explaining fully why he left the Covenant religion. As a quick aside, the Great Journey is the Covenant's ultimate goal. The Covenant religion believes the Forerunners discovered a method to transcend the physical world and achieve divinity, accomplished by constructing and firing the Halo Rings. The Covenant believe that by locating and activating the Rings themselves, they will transcend and walk among the Forerunners as divine beings. 343 Guilty Spark is seen as an oracle of the Forerunners and is held in high regard by the Covenant. He is taken back to High Charity, where a distress call comes in from Regret, who has realized he's been followed by the humans. Wasting no time, High Charity and the Covenant race to Regret's location. As they arrive, Master Chief has made the killing blow, ending Regret's life. But he's unable to escape, as the Covenant start blasting the area. Master Chief jumps into a lake, incapacitated by the shock of the bombardment, then is mysteriously dragged into the depths of the lake by some tentacles. Shifting back to the Arbiter on High Charity, the two remaining Prophets put the blame on the entire race of Elites for the death of Regret. They decide that the Elites will no longer be the protectors of the Prophets, and instead bestow that honor to the Brutes. The already tense relationship between the Elites and Brutes becomes even more bitter. Truth and Mercy inquire Guilty Spark on how to activate Halo, who informs them they'll need a sacred icon. The Arbiter is tasked with retrieving this activation index. As the Arbiter fights his way through the Flood and Sentinels, Forerunner drones created to suppress Flood outbreaks, he discovers the library and captures the Index, along with Keyes and Johnson. Moments later, Tartarus shows up, takes the Index, and reveals the Hierarchs have ordered the elimination of Elites. He knocks the Arbiter unconscious and throws him down a deep shaft. We return to Master Chief, who is in the clutches of the Gravemind, a creature which acts as the sentient intelligence of the Flood. The Gravemind saves the Arbiter from his fall, and he and Master Chief meet for the first time. Another AI monitor, 2401 Penitent Tangent, introduces itself as the manager of Installation 05, the current Halo ring everyone is stationed on. The Gravemind and Master Chief explain to the Arbiter that Halo is a weapon, and the Covenant's belief is a lie. It destroys life, not save it. His faith shaken, the Arbiter reluctantly joins Master Chief in his mission to stop the ring from being activated. The Gravemind sends each of them to different locations to stop the Index from reaching its destination. Master Chief is sent to High Charity, where a civil war has broken out among the Covenant. The UNSC ship, in amber clad, is seen crashing into the city, and Cortana realizes that the Gravemind used them as a distraction to infest the ship and spread the Flood. The Parasite overruns the city, consuming the Prophet of Mercy in the process. His final order is for Tartarus to take Keys, Johnson, and Guilty Spark to Halo's control room and activate the ring. Master Chief follows Truth aboard a Forerunner ship, leaving the city. Cortana stays behind to destroy High Charity and Halo in the event Tartarus succeeds in activating the ring. The Arbiter was sent to the surface of Halo, where he rallies the Elites to assault the Brute's position. With Johnson's help, he confronts Tartarus in the control room. The Arbiter tries to convince Tartarus that the Prophets have betrayed them both, but Tartarus activates the ring. Working together, the Arbiter and Johnson kill Tartarus and remove the Index. But instead of shutting down the ring entirely, a system-wide failsafe protocol is triggered, putting Installation 05 and all other Halo rings on standby for activation from a remote location, which Guilty Spark refers to as the Ark. As Truth's ship arrives amidst a raging battle on Earth, the Commander asks Master Chief what he's doing aboard the ship. He replies, Sir, Finishing, finishing this, this fight. fight.
They let me pick. Did I ever tell you that? Choose whichever Spartan I wanted. You know me. I did my research, watched as you became the soldier we needed you to be. Like the others, you are strong and swift and brave. A natural leader. But you had something they didn't. Something no one saw but me. Can you guess? Luck. Was I wrong? This ain't good. Damn. How far did he fall? Two kilometers. Easy. Stay sharp. Gorman, his armor's locked up. Gel layer could have taken most of the impact. I don't know, Sergeant Major. for Vitor. Heavy lift gear. We're not leaving him here. Yeah, you're not. Oh, crazy fool. Why do you always jump? One of these days, you're gonna land on something as stubborn as you are. And I don't do bits and pieces. Where is she, Chief? Where's Cortana? Don't make a girl a promise, if you know you can't keep it. She stayed behind. Corporal, make it quick. Sorry, sir. Your armor's still in partial lockdown. Chief, wait! The Arbiter's with us! Come on, now. You've got enough to worry about without you two trying to kill each other. Were it so easy? We must go. The brutes have our scent. And they must love the smell of green. All right. You're a squad, you're my scouts. Arbiter, watch the chief's back. Move out, quiet as you can. Where's the arbiter? You're the Arbiter. Oh, so I am. Yeah, you're the Arbiter. See, it's actually really hey. cool because it... Oh, shoot, Are sorry. you serious? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> the moving, Chief. Oh my god. The first damage that I took in the game is from Mallory. Yeah, Mallory, you're the Arbiter. In Halo 2, um, you... There's Instead a few of missions. Double Master Chief. Yeah, and there's a few times where you're Double Master Chief or Double Arbiters. Uh, I think there are a few missions where you play one as each, but um, yeah, in, in this game you actually get to be separate because we're traveling together anyway. I think for most, if not all, the game? So yeah, you're the Arbiter. Okay, one the, cool. One of the cool things is that um, your weapons are actually different. Uh -huh. So, Like I have energy grenades and you don't? Yeah, you have sticky grenades. Yeah. Uh, and Actually, grenade because you already threw one at my my it crotch. It didn't stick which to I, you though. I appreciate. It bounced off. Yeah, that's you. because you're not supposed to kill your friends, Mallory. You learned nothing from Halo 2. Uh, otherwise, I have an assault rifle and a battle rifle. You have got a Covenant. Uh, is that is it the Covenant carbine? I think it's a Covenant carbine and a plasma rifle. Also, I'm going to point it out right freaking now, because in Halo 2, I had so many people say that's actually carbine. It can be pronounced both ways. I'm serious. Look it up. Look it up in the dictionary. It can be pronounced both carbine and carbine. It is okay. I am allowed to say carbine. 
And I, I usually use both of them interchangeably, but I may call it a carbine. Please don't flip out on me. Bravo I love you all, awesome. and it. I appreciate it. Fall back to the extraction point. Over. Roger that. Reynolds out. So, um, I'm pretty sure that there's no, um, in-game subtitles, which really sucks, and I hate it in Halo 2, but it's a thing, so... We will just do our best to shut up whenever the people are talking. That will be the plan. Johnson, you be advised. Hostiles are on the move. I've got eyes on a brute. Over. Say again, Gunny. You're breaking up. Ooh. <laughs> what did you ooh about? I can stand on this log. Oh my god. Yes, Mallory. Welcome to video games 20 years ago. Uh, I gotta say, though, it's actually... I really like Halo. Uh, I like first-person shooters, I'm a big fan, but Halo in particular, it, it has such such Sergeant rich Major. lore. Phantom inbound. And uh, it's it's a fun we game to play. Let's split up. Meet back at the LZ. But I also uh, you and the Arbiter head toward the river. Got it. Second Thank squad. you. You're with me. Why can't there be subtitles? I swear. Uh, but one of the things I, I enjoy is, like, the physics of it all. The fact that I can jump around. I'm a super soldier. And it's really great. So they're going up the waterfall. <laughs> Apparently Mallory's also going, going up the waterfall. I wanna go up the waterfall. You don't get to choose, Mallory! No, oh, come on. Let me go with you. You're gonna end up killing those poor men. <sighs> okay, so I guess we go this way with these men? Good lord. Um, yeah, uh, you can also switch out weapons like you could in the past games. Not that I want a, a Left magnum. bumper? Left trigger? Please. Please, God. They will turn on us if you if you do enough damage to them. Alright, so we've got to be sneaky sneaky. And as long as we're sneaky sneaky... Hey, guys! Do they know we're here? I don't know, they said spread out. Oh, there's one up there. Uh, I think he knows. Does he know? He knows. He knows now because I'm shooting him in the head. Yeah, take that, butthole! You don't like that very much, do ya? Hey. Alright, reload. Alright, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. There's someone who's upset at me. <laughs> well, what did you do to upset them? Now? They said, find your own kills. <laughs> oh, as a side note, and I gotta mention this now because I know someone is going to ask. We are playing on normal. Ooh, weapons. And the reason, the reason we're playing on it, what is this? No idea. Uh, the reason we're playing on normal is because we'll probably die. <laughs> That's the best reason I can Ooh, give you. there's a ship. Oh, we got, we got some friends. Careful. Uh! Yeah, that's right, buttholes! Careful, 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 careful. Ah, 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 ah! Trying to get behind something, but I can't get behind something because there ain't nothing but a gun! I did good. Good. Continue to do good. Shoot them in the head brain. And then they will be... And then they will be dead deceased. Uh, we got plasma pistols everywhere. Which I'm <laughs> that not, one just flipped. I'm not particularly a fan of. Oh, hello, friend. How are you? We're gonna be fighting, uh, quite a bit of brutes. In, in the event that you skipped the, uh... In the event you skipped the little intro thing that I did, um... For one, I hope you know what Halo 3 is about, because that really helps. Um, but the Brutes are kind of the ones that are allied with the Prophets now, because they kind of kicked out the Elites. Um, that's why... I mean, I think occasionally you'll still find some Elites that fight against us, because they're like Loyalists or something. Because it's all it's all a religious thing to them, so like they, they still want to be on the right side of religion and uh, part of the Great Journey. But they more or less got kicked out, so that's why uh, the Brutes kind of took over as the Protectors. And they're the ones that we're going to uh, see. Um, also... Uh, Mao, there's something I needed to point out because it's new in Halo 3 and you probably don't remember it. Yeah? Equipment. Uh, see the little symbol that's under your grenades up in the top yeah, left the corner? Yeah, the little shield thing? Yes, and that is. It's a shield. Uh, oh. You activate those by pressing X. And there's a bunch of various ones. There's shields, there's uh, gravity lifts, there's all sorts of fun things. So if you get in a pickle and you're like, oh god, I'm gonna die, activate your bubble shield, it will protect you. I'll try to remember. 
Uh, as we get further in the game, you'll probably remember. You'll see people doing it, and you'll be like, oh, yeah. I'd really like more grenades. So you can throw them at me? Yeah. No. So I can use them. That's what we got up here. Let's be careful. Nice. He's dead. Uh, are they aware that we're here? Yeah, the marines are running forward. Yeah, we're fine. Just keep going. Um, we got some of these things. These are, uh, these are brute weapons, and I can never remember the names of them. Spikers? Something like that? Uh, either way, it's, uh, it's like a pistol. I'm not particularly interested in it. Uh, let's see, what's the flashlight? I don't remember how to use the flashlight. Crap. How? Darn, I don't- Oh, God! Well, I accidentally activated my thing, so that's something. I can come in here with you. You can. Um, it's probably pretty oh, obvious, but you can't so fire. Cute. You can't fire inside or out. If you throw a grenade while in that, everyone in it will die. You know, just be careful with that. Got that guy. Hey, buddy. Piece of crap. Got him. Uh, I am pretty much out of ammo with this. Oh, friend, friend, friend. Punch in the face! I think I knocked his head off. That's unfortunate for him. Alright, let's see. Who else is here? Oh, there's a lot of enemies! Good god, I got stuck with a needle. Stay frosty, Mel. What do we got over oh, here? Oh, I got switch weapons! Yeah, you may have to, and it looks like, uh... Looks like it's happening. Yeah, I don't really remember the name of this weapon, but I'm gonna have to use it because, uh, it's got ammo all over the place. Son of a gun. Don't forget you can dual wield also. Certain weapons. Not all the weapons, but a lot of them. Okay, I'm gonna dive and I'll be careful. Don't get killed. Don't get killed. It's really bad when you're killed. Cause then you're dead and that's no fun. Gotta keep the enemies on the run. You piece of crap! No, 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 no. Ugh. Oh, I tried to melee him, but I hit the wrong button. Pretty sure if you melee, whenever you have two weapons, you drop one of the weapons. I think that's how it works. I will test this. It is true. Just something to Ooh, keep in mind. Ooh, I got mind. a needler. Yes, and you, uh, in this game, you cannot dual wield the needler. Which might make you sad, but they determined that it was a little too OP. I'm and, dual wielding and, something. And to be fair, it is, so that makes sense. They dead? They're dead. Actually, this, this gun's okay. Pelicans are on route, Chief. Alright, good to know. Ammo, 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 ammo. Uh, let's see, do we keep going this way? This looks correct. Checkpoint done, seems right. Oh, there you are, I was lost. I'm also pretty sure that, um, just like in past games, if I, um, if I go far enough from you, you will instantly teleport yep, to me? Yep, I did that once already. It's really disorienting. I mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> Just stay focused and keep looking for me when you have times of trouble! I will save you, and it will be good. Got another checkpoint. Are we good? Are we safe? Oh, these poor dead people, but also I can get my gun back. Although, honestly, I kind of like these. I, I don't know, I was, like, predisposed to not use them, but now that I have them, I'm like, eh, they're actually okay. I think I'll kill more people with their own guns. No, you don't, little friends. No, Oh, hi, big fella. You're very dead. You got, you got shot in the leg one too many times, bucko. Uh, jump into a tree. Oh, I can't. We're working to, on it. I was trying to jump into a tree. And, uh, it didn't work out, which is unfortunate. What do you reckon? He looked pretty good in my hallway. <laughs> I think that Marine said he'd look pretty good... In, in my hallway? In my hallway as a rug. Ah! Uh, uh, Could you oh. sacrifice me to complete your mission? Could you watch me die? That was kind of frightening. Sir, you okay? Your vitals just ping KIA. Hmm. Charlie Foxtrot. Yeah, uh, get used to the Cortana thing. That may or may not be happening a few more times. 
Uh, let's see here. What we got? Another battle rifle and some grenades. Um, yeah. We may have to be doing some sniping soon. We gotta go help our dudes. Where's our dudes? They're here. Help our dudes! <laughs> our dudes need help! <laughs> they prefer to be called dudes, of course. Also, they call Master Chief the Demon, which I find hilarious. Oh no, the Pelican! They're fine, unless they crash, in which case then they weren't. Hey, it was one of those dudes with a shield. Another one! A ton of grenades. Find Johnson's crashed Pelican. Oh god, ow. Sorry. Yeah, they don't appreciate it when you shoot them. There is friendly fire for teammates. So be careful not to put a bullet in their bunghole. Or anywhere else, for that matter. Alright, I'm gonna follow up here. See what I can see. We're doing pretty good. We're moving. Ooh, I uh, got more grenades. Moving efficiently. Are they behind us? Oh no, they're in front of us. Hey, little friends, what's going on? Where'd you go? Oh, he's got a brute shot. Be careful. That's the uh, it's the brute version of their uh, like a grenade launcher type thing. Uh huh. Although yeah. you could also find one laying around, so be on the lookout. I don't see one. Oh wait, here's one. Hmm. There's uh, not much ammo for it. Give me this thing. What's up, friend? Ugh! Direct hit. Yeah, that's right. Jump off the cliff. I killed the big dude on my own. Which one? The one on the rock? No, the one that had the brute shot. Oh. Well, good. I took the brute shot. Let's There's one. The if you want it. Nah. All right, checkpoint done. Things are going well. Things are going very well. Can't complain whatsoever. I'm happy with my weapon choice as well. Can you hear me? My bird's down. Half a click down on your position. Got it. That pipe was pissing on me. We're moving half a click. <laughs> Uh, that, I mean, that's an actual unit of measurement. I know it is. I just don't know how far it measures. Oh, you son of a gun. It's not the primary weapon I should be using for that activity. I wish I had my battle rifle, but I also want to blow people up. It's so hard to make these choices. Oh, our men are exploding. Who did that? Where are you? Are there was me? a guy in the tree, but I killed him. Nice, good job. Because I wasn't watching for him at all. I've actually found even more ammo for the brute shot, so I'm pretty satisfied. What a Boom! <laughs> I think I sent him to hell. All right, let's see here. One of the bad guys up there. Boom! Find Johnson before he's captured. Got it. Working on it. Working on it. Ugh. Pretty good. God, the brute shot is a fun weapon. Get out of town! This guy way, way up there. Get out of town! I think I got him. Holy crap. Boom, baby! What up, son? Weehaw! I'm wasting ammo at this point. Oh, God. There we go. Oh, that I'm was being shot. A actually... lot. Oh, my God. Oh, Get out much... of there, Mal. Get out of there. Much being shot. Unfortunately, if you die in the game, you die for real. It's a special effect of the Master Chief collection. So you're going to want to keep that in check. Hi, friend. Boom! Where's friends? That's right. Gotcha, gotcha. Whoa, I think he shot my grenade in midair. Let's try that again, shall we? Careful. God, he's still alive. Oh, Lord. There, oh, there was someone to the side of me. Yeah, I grenaded him. There's a radar I should probably make sure I pay very close attention to. Don't mind me, I'm just a cleanup crew. Took care of this trash. Alright, I think we're looking pretty good. There's a few more over here. From downtown! Found him. Nice. I apparently found more ammo, too. You found a little pocket of them now? Yeah. Oh, oh. hey. What's up, friend? Ugh! We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh! What do we have here? 
the big one dead? The big one's not dead. Careful. Oh, God. I think... Did I get him? I might have got him. I got him. Woo! All right, Mal. Don't walk through there. Why? Because the episode's Oh, over. I already did. <laughs> hey. Well, I tried to stop you. I did what I could. Uh, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. That is the first episode of Halo 3. Much, uh, many more fun adventures between <laughs> Master Chief and the Arbiter await. I can't wait to it's shoot more people. It's like a 90s people. sitcom. Uh, yeah, except I'm, I'm pretty sure that not many sitcoms resulted in the death of an entire species. Hey, guess who has grenades? Mallory. Is that right? No. Left trigger? No. Is that no. right trigger? No!